The year was 1977 at the Ohio State University's Big Ear Radio Telescope. Astronomers were dedicated to the search for extraterrestrial intelligence, or SETI. They were listening for a signal, a needle in the cosmic haystack that would prove we are not alone. On August 15th, they found it. For exactly 72 seconds, the telescope received an anomalous signal so loud, so focused, and so perfectly aligned with the theoretical properties of an interstellar broadcast that it instantly shattered all known scientific norms. Dr. Jerry Amon, the astronomer reviewing the printout, was so stunned by the intensity of the reading that he circled the alphanumeric code and scrawled the single word, wow. The circled sequence, 6 EQUJ5, represented a signal strength 30 times louder than the background noise of deep space. It arrived at the specific radio frequency of 1420 megahertz, a wavelength known as the hydrogen line, which is the most likely frequency an intelligent species would use. Crucially, the signal originated from the direction of the constellation Sagittarius, a region of space where no stars or planets were known at the time. It was a beacon from 220 million light years away. Scientists immediately began searching, turning the telescope back to the exact location of the signal, and then again and again for years. They searched for decades. The powerful, focused transmission was never heard from again. Was this a deliberate, one-time broadcast from an alien civilization? Or a profound natural anomaly we still don't understand? To this day, the wow. Signal remains the strongest evidence we have of something truly intelligent, far out in the dark.